Hello there ladies and gentlemen, this is your friendly neighborhood Oxhorn and I've rigged up this little scenario to demonstrate how electricity and conduits work in vault Tech Workshop, in particular this vault Tech wall powered conduit, which can be a little confusing. I've heard people in the comments section of my videos asking questions about it and I've seen a lot of confusion online. But before we could talk about that, we need to understand how electricity works with walls and floors in vault Tech Workshop. And to do that, we need to run to the very end of this facility to check out this yes. fusion generator. This is the fusion generator that comes with vault 88. And as you can see, it produces 150 power. This is the vault Tech reactor. It's snapped into the floor and power courses through the walls of this facility all the way up these stairs and through every little bit of wall floor and ceiling that you see it's invisible to you and it can be kind of tricky to harness if you don't understand how it works so as you can see i have three lights on this wall and a fluorescent ceiling light attached to the wall right there but none of them are lit up even though they're attached to walls and floors the reason for that is because this entire little network that I've put rigged for an experiment is disconnected from all these floors, which are connected to the reactor and the rest of the facility. So in order to get these powered, I first have to connect the base that these pieces of equipment are attached to, to the rest of the facility. And I can do that by simply placing a floor. You see how that works? Now, power courses through the floor all the way to this facility and everything turns on. Uh, turns on. Now, there are a couple of things. This obviously is not turned on. I can't interact with it, um, and I'll explain why in just a second. Now, the reason this is all working is due to this vault power conduit. Let's remove it so I can show you what I mean. You see how all the lights turned off? The reason for that is because even though power is coursing through the walls and the floors, these um, these lights are not directly connected to that power by a wire like you would typically expect. And what these normally need is a radiated power source. That's why if you put a conduit on the wall, power radiates from that conduit, kind of like Wi-Fi, to turn these lights on. Now what this vault power conduit does is it punctures into the wall, harnesses the power, and radiates it out of this little sticky out bit right there. Think of this as a Wi-Fi antenna, only it's sending out power to everything around it that can capture it. Now this is not turning on because it requires an actual wire. Uh, so let's connect this to this new conduit that came with vault Tech Workshop, this white one right there. And you'll notice that nothing happens. It's still not powered. And the reason for that is because these little conduits act just like the old conduits that came with the game. Unless these are directly powered, they're not going to deliver power. So in order to get this powered, we first have to wire it to the vault power, the vault uh, power conduit that is connected to the electricity in the wall. And now we can interact with the terminal. It now works. Of course, if you wanted to, you could directly connect it to the vault power conduit. I uh, simply went about it this roundabout way to demonstrate how this power conduit is different from this one and uh, everything else. And that is the basics of power. As long as you have floors and or walls that are connected to other floors and walls that are connected to a generator or reactor, you too will be able to power your facility. Well, uh, I hope this short video was useful. I just wanted to clarify how this power situation worked in vault Tech Workshop. If you have any other questions about this or any other topic, please let me know in the comments below and I'll do my very best to produce a video to answer your questions. Thank you all so much for, for watching. Please subscribe for more vault Tech Workshop content. Your subscriptions keep this channel alive and I'll see you all very soon.